So LinkedIn Learning is about engaging the whole community and it's about engaging families between maternal health, nurse play groups, kindergartens and school settings so that it doesn't matter where you go in Thomastown, uh, you can be engaged, not just the children are engaged but the family is also engaged. So if we can do that, if we can build those relationships and make those connections, then I think people are more likely to want to work together to create better opportunities um, for the children of Thomastown. I think what's most exciting for me is getting to know the community even better and certainly knowing what is out there that will help our families feel supported. The benefits from this for the child are that they're going through their journey with a group of people who already know them, who are linked in through maternal and child health in the beginning and the team around the child grows and the family can feel as though they're really supported and everybody cares about their child. So rather than having kinder, then school, it, it's becoming one process because the links, the communication is already in place. They've got familiarisation with school kids because they come to our kinder and so when they go to school they know that there's going to be bigger school kids and they know some things because they've already visited the schools and, and things like that. So it becomes a really smooth, seamless transition. My first day of school I remember walking through those front gates with my mum and I was with my bag, my first time ever wearing an actual uniform. Um, I walked into class, I had some friends that I'd met on orientation day. Um, I remember walking in and I saw my friend from kindergarten. He was there and we were both playing with the Lego. And then other kids wanted to join in and I remember that day we built like a little castle and we were playing a good game, it was fun. Learning is a shared responsibility, it's not just for an individual school to be um, teaching these children and educating these children. It's about the community working together to educate all the children in Thomastown to, um, to make them better, more um, effective learners. It does connect because you see a different world when you're in the classroom and you sort of go home and you think, oh, it does connect because you're constantly helping the kids in the class. Then you come home and you're teaching your own children at home as well. So you sort of learn what the teachers are teaching and you can teach it at home yourself. We know that the children are only at the school for 20% of the time, so 80% of the time, learning is happening everywhere. It's happening at home and, and outside in the community. So it's really valuing the the input and um, the parents, the parents' beliefs and understandings and knowledge, and really working with them to um, to realise that the parents, what the parents teach the children, is critical to their long-term development. So having the opportunity to network with others and learn from each other, um, share the professional learning that's going to be available to them as well, plus the learning that they're going to get just by conversation, just through conversation is going to be amazing. I'm, I'm absolutely positive about that one. I'm very passionate personally about engaging community and meeting the needs of this community. Um, I, I see refugee families, I see families come with, with very disadvantaged, very limited English and they just want a better life. They just want to have success for them and their families. So we, we want to engage the families to say, hey, there are choices out there. We can help not just with education, but we can help with community needs as well. You need support in this area, we can link you in to agencies or people that can help support your family no matter what your situation is. So it's again, linking learning, which is what the whole project is entitled.